Next week, Sean Connery stars as an Arab king who tries to bring peace to the Middle East, but whose plans are thwarted by various governments out for profit. The action adventure, The Next Man, next week at 10.30. And tomorrow night at 7.30, The Professionals, four men hired to recapture a beautiful woman from the clutches of a Mexican revolution. Raza, the bloodiest cutthroat in Mexico. Your job, a mission of mercy. What's the deal? $10,000 per man for nine days' work. Go with God. Now, all you got to do is light this fuse. And then dynamite, not faith, will move that mountain into this pass. Peace, brother. Bert Lancaster, Woody Strode, Robert Ryan and Lee Marvin are the professionals tomorrow night at 7.30 here on ITV. Red Mountain isn't like regular coffee. Regular coffee doesn't even come close. Because Red Mountain is chips of coffee. Solid, freeze-dried chips of real coffee. Richer roasted for a bigger taste. Right in your cup. Will the next pint you order be as good as Guinness? Will it have a smooth, deep, black body? Will it have a cool, creamy white head? And will it be able, in front of your very eyes, to produce its head out of its body? Pardon? Next time you order a pint, ask for a Guinness and say a little birdie sent you. Oh. Each of the big five building societies has an extra interest plan. Fine. But what happens if your car suddenly comes a cropper? Your boiler blows up. You need your money in a hurry. Too bad. Unless you invest at the Leeds, the only one of the big five to permit instant withdrawals on an extra interest account. And now it's improved three ways. Say the Leeds and smile. Smile. Did you know that one of the world's most modern copper mines is run by Britain's most experienced specialist zoo animal feeder? <laughs> or that the world's most advanced system for turning rocks into home insulation is run by Britain's leading spacecraft lubricators? That is a giant step for a truck driver. Or that the most successful oil field in the North Sea is operated by Britain's biggest private taxpayer? One more for the tax man. Thank you. Did you know that fuel and oil for the farmers is supplied by one of Britain's most versatile computer programmers? <laughs> hey, <Oop. laughs> Where paint makers, gold miners, lubricators and refiners sailing ships and farming fishes, finding gas and washing dishes, laying pipelines, drilling, testing, backing Britain by investing. BP. Britain at its best. When my business started to take off, we couldn't cope with all the extra work. The job really began to get on top of us. Fortunately, help arrived in the nick of time. The Xerox 2350 plain paper copier. It copies photographs of all my products, pages from the middle of my catalog. It easily handles circulars, makes addressing an absolute doddle, and the Xerox 2350 reduces large pages to half size, which saves paperwork, postage, and filing. This leaves more time for some of us to do the more important filing. The Xerox 2350 reduces business problems down to size. For more information, free phone 2279 anytime. Now, Signal has extra fluoride in the red stripes that's absorbed onto teeth, helping protect through daily danger zones, times of danger from plaque and decay. So Signal's fluoride keeps working through break and lunch through snacks and supper. Brush twice every day with Signal. Its fluoride keeps on protecting through daily danger zones. And so now to our final program for this evening, and you're invited to sit up and listen once again in the company of Jack Jones. <laughs> I expect that many listeners have experienced rough treatment at the hands of people in authority. Sometimes they are people with little real authority, 
with their adept at shuffling papers and displaying impatience to the nth degree. Such folk display their inferiority and ignorance while revealing an apparent contempt for their fellow man. No wonder William Shakespeare wrote, Man, proud man, dressed in a little brief authority, most ignorant of what he's most assured. His glossy essence, like an angry ape, plays such fantastic tricks before high heaven as make the angels weep. We all require to have a little humility and respect for others, because in the words of John Donne, we are all involved in mankind. Those fine words of John Donne's, written centuries ago, still have meaning for us all. No man is an island, entire of itself. Every man is a piece of the continent, a part of the main. If a clod be washed away by the sea, Europe is the less, as well as if a promontory were, as well as a manner of thy friends or of thine own were. Any man's death diminishes me, because I am involved in mankind, and therefore never send to know for whom the bell tolls. It tolls for thee. And before we take our leave, uh, here's a look at the weather forecast for the Thames television area. Overnight, the rain clearing and some fog developing, but uh, the good news is no frost. Tomorrow, broken cloud and sunshine, dry and a high temperature of 10 degrees centigrade. Transfer, that's just 50 degrees Fahrenheit. And that's just about it. Uh, I'll leave you with a look at Thursday's programmes. The music comes from a gentleman who calls himself Groover Washington. The number in question is Make Me a Memory. I hope you'll remember to join us at some point in the proceedings tomorrow. On behalf of all of us here at our Houston Rose Studios. I'll wish you a very good night and sleep well. Good night, everyone. Don't forget, please, to switch off your television set and remember to remove the plug from the wall socket. Good night again.